Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ankush. In our today's video, we'll be discussing about high vectorization. So whenever you're going for an interview, definitely you'll see a lot of questions based upon the high performance tuning. So when we are talking about the performance tuning related to the hive, the vectorization plays an important role. So let us try to understand what is meant by vectorization and how it is helpful uh, for the improvement of your hive queries. So let me open the paint and that will be more easy to understand the things. Currently the hive execution engine, uh, it always process one one record. So let's take one example saying like this is your table okay and here you have a multiple records over here okay let's say these are the multiple records i'm taking one one row now if i want to process something let's say uh, the where we need to do some kind of joinings or scan operation or any kind of the group by like operation so basically how you process one 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 record like that it will take one record it will process it, it will take second record, it will process it, third record. So here what is happening here, your CPU is not utilizing much. Okay, let's say you have a good amount of CPU, but it is not getting utilized. Because at a time it is only taking one row. All the time it is taking one one row. Now what we can do, is it possible to take a directly a bunch of record from the table and process it yes that is possible with the help of vectorization so in the vectorization we will take a bunch of record at a time and that record count is coming it as 1024 rows in one block okay so it will process 1024 rows directly at a time and in the next process again it will take 1024 rows and because of that time what will happen your execution of your query will be more faster and you can expect a better performance whenever you are doing the operation like it can be a join scan any operation like that all the operation can be done with the help of uh, vectorization so for that what you need to do you need to enable the vectorization so we need to enable so how to enable this vectorization? So this is how you can enable the vectorization. If you want to enable the vectorization, you can set high.vectorization.execution.enable equals true. If you don't want to enable the vectorization, then you can make it as false. Okay. So this is the importance of vectorization in the hive. And I think you guys should use this uh, feature which has been provided by the cloud data with the hive and this is one of the best feature I believe if you want to increase the performance of your hive okay if you are looking for Hadoop training definitely you can contact me and please do like subscribe and share this channel if you want to learn about more and more Hadoop related interview questions because all the time I am only publishing the videos based upon Hadoop as well as other technology which is mainly useful in the interview process. Bye bye. See you again with the next video.